What's up guys, it's Alex from Everyday Biking, and today my dad will be taking us through a six step process to service a Fox 34 fork. Step zero, before beginning the maintenance, you must have a Fox fork seal kit and the correct fluids for your fork. If you're planning to replace the seals, it's best to have a seal insertion tool. It's easiest if you remove the fork from your bike. Take note of the current air pressure and damper settings, then depressurize the fork and set your damper fully open. Step 1. Remove the lower legs. First, remove your damper knob, then remove the damper and spring nuts and crush washers. If you don't have a lower leg removal tool, leave the nuts on loosely and use a rubber mallet to release the fork lowers from the uppers. Make sure to use a socket on the damper side to protect the damper adjust shaft. Remove the nuts, throw away your old crush washers, and make sure you use new ones. Get a bucket to catch the oil that will be drained out of the fork. Separate the lower legs from the fork. Clean off as much of the oil from the fork as you can at this point. Step 2. Service the lower legs. If you are planning to replace the seals, use a wrench to carefully remove the old seals and foam oil rings, making sure not to damage the metal inside the fork. They can be quite hard to remove. Use some paper towels or rags and alcohol to clean out the inside of the lower legs. You want to remove as much of the old oil as possible. Make sure you don't use any metallic objects which may scratch the inside of the fork. Put the new oil rings in 20 weight oil for 10 minutes so they are well saturated for later. Step 3. Service the air spring. Carefully remove the clip holding the air spring in place. Remove the air spring top cap. Make sure you use a special socket without chamfers so it's not to damage it. Now pull out the air spring piston. Clean out all the oil and grease in the inside of the air spring. Step 4. Reassemble the air spring. Use some slicoleum or equivalent to grease up the air spring piston. Apply a thin layer of grease to the seals and shaft. Reinsert the piston into the fork leg and put the retaining clip back in place. Pull on the shaft to make sure it is firmly in place and doesn't come loose. Add 3 cc's of 20 weight oil and replace the air spring top cap. Pump up the air spring to your normal pressure to help with reassembly. Step 5. Reassemble the fork lowers. Put the oil soaked foam rings into the top of the fork. Lightly lube the outside of the new seal. Use the seal driver to install the new seals making sure the seal edge is flush with the fork. Replace the old o-ring. Step 6. Reinstall the lower legs. Carefully slide the lowers back onto the fork taking care around the seals. Add the right oil to the bottom of each leg. For a fox grip fork, add 10 cc's of 20 weight oil to the air spring side and 40 cc's of 5 weight oil to the damper side. Give the fork a final wipe. Reinstall the nuts with new crush washers and torque to the appropriate setting. Finally, reinstall the damper knob, making sure it lines up correctly. With that, you are done servicing your fork. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let us know in the comment section down below what service video you want next. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe. Make sure to use the link down below to join our community discord, to join an awesome community of mountain bikers and get so many cool benefits. And also follow us on Instagram at Everyday Biking and we'll see you guys next week. See ya!